It's your boy Good Guy Activism. We here at the Seventh Precinct in the Lower East Side of Manhattan, New York, New York City, New York. Let's go take a look at this vehicle. Go check up on it. My privacy screen is cracked. It's really messing with me because I don't know if it's the. Uh, I don't know if it's the, uh, I don't know if it's the screen protector, if it's the privacy screen, or if it's my actual screen. I don't think it's the, uh, I don't think it's my actual screen. This guy's getting out of his car. Up, sir. I'm okay, thank you. Yeah, no, you can stop recording now. What, what is, what's the worst thing about recording in the, car, in the car? What's your name? Officer Barnes. And your badge number? 17944. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. What's your name? Guy. Hmm? Guy. Guy what? Freeman. You're happy to record on the side of the car for what? You stopped eating a pizza to come talk to me for what? Yeah, because I dropped off some kids. That's what's up. Yeah, okay. And I see some stranger recording in a car, so I got to ask some questions for you. Recording in public is strange. When you're recording in a car, when I've got kids coming in and out of the car, it's kind of weird to me. I don't see no kids here. No kids right there. How am so I supposed to know? Can you leave? I'm okay. I'm on a sidewalk. I don't give a shit if you're on a sidewalk. Why are you cursing? I hope you like it. Have a good day. Okay, you too. All right. All right. Have a good day. You too. Go. You gonna curse in front of the kids too? I'm gonna ask you a question. I curse in front of you. Are right? you gonna curse in front of them too? You I don't give a fuck because they're inside the car right now. Yeah. You having fun, right? I'm telling them out of my business. Me I didn't too. come up to you. You came up to me. You came up you to came me in the up, car. I came up to the car. Listen, have a good night, all right? Don't touch me. Give me a card. Nope. Give me a card. Who's that? Fucking tyrant. Listen, just do me a favor, okay? Don't touch me, bro. Listen, I'm just trying to help you out. Help you out. Why do not you record, me? Do not record me when I'm with my kids, all right? Don't tell me what to do. I'm going to tell you what to do. Don't record the car Don't ahead. tell me what to do. You a bitch. You a bitch. And I was just talking about how my privacy screen, my privacy screen is cracked. Now it's even more cracked. This nigga's a bitch, bro. Let's go inside and file a complaint on this nigga. Talk to his sergeant. That's why I need my fucking tripod back. This nigga just smacked my phone out of my hand. Then walked away. What's that officer's name that was in that car just now? Sure. The one that just dropped off those kids? Him, it was a male and a female? Mm. There was a, a, an African-American, I'm it's presuming. Yeah. Is your no, sergeant? I... Tall, dark skin, cross-eyed? Cross-eyed. No, Overweight? Uh, I'm sorry, I didn't know this. Is your sergeant here that I can speak to, please? Yeah. He just smacked my phone out of my hand. Okay. Twice. Because I was recording on the sidewalk. Oh, okay. It's crazy. It's sad. Your hmm? officer just smacked the phone on my hand twice. For no reason. Because I'm exercising my rights, bro. What kind of shit is that? He's a fucking disgrace, bro. Officers like that is a disgrace, bro. You're a fucking disgrace. Because I'm recording you while you're at work and you're a public servant. And you swore to protect my rights? And then you file a CCRB. CCRB don't do shit. Mm -mm -mm. No, and damn well he wouldn't do that shit out of uniform. What the fuck? How tall you are, bro? 
just want to follow him. I just want to speak to a, a supervisor. Hopefully, I don't know, bro. I'm so this. This is discouraging, bro. When, when there's no accountability and you got officers acting like that, and I'm like, let me tell his sergeant. Maybe his sergeant will have a word with him. And then I, in, my, in the back of my head, is like, what is the sergeant gonna do? Good job. Tell him good job. And this has nothing to do with you. This is my experience in recording police for over two years. Okay. That most of them hate when you record them. They hate it. Just that's just, and I'm not saying it's no offense to none of y'all. In my experience personally, that's the disdain that I get for simply just recording on the on the sidewalk. And then you wanna you want accountability. You hope there's accountability, but then you look at people's jackets and they got 20 complaints, three hundred thousand dollars in lawsuits, and it's like they still roam the streets doing whatever they want. I ask them for a card. The right to know law is it's a law. He violates that. He don't want to give me his card. But you want to go hands-on. You want to smack my phone out of the hand. That's cool. And that's why I record. Um, so you don't have the complaint form, right? Uh, and your sorry, sergeant, I, I try to get it. And your sergeant, and your sergeant is busy? I just want to... I just want to Where did this uh, happen? Right in front of the precinct. He's just dropped off some kids. Uh-huh. Some kids just came in here. And then he said, don't record, don't record me while I'm with my kids. I don't know. I don't, he said his name, but I forgot. That's why I like business cards. I, I've, I've been playing football 28 years. Mm-hmm. My short-term memory's not always there, you know what I mean? Nice. Look at my phone, bro. Fucking, it's almost a thousand dollar phone, and you smacking it out of my hand. <clears throat> that shit got me so mad right now. Not even mad, just like... That shit is sad, bro. Don't be like that. Don't be like that. That's sad. Does he have the time to talk? If not, it's all right. If he doesn't, he doesn't. It's all right. Yeah. Thank you. Let's expose this nigga, bro. We're gonna expose this nigga. So, excuse me. Yo, I wanted to hook on him, bro. Woof. Woof. I wanted to hook this nigga, bro. Oh. Oh, my lord. Ah, he's a bitch. He's getting exposed, bro. That's crazy. Never. First time somebody ever smacked the phone out of my hand, bro. And usually I got my tripod, bro. You ain't smacking shit. My son lost a, lost one of the pieces to my tripod, so I, I can't even use it no more, man. I gotta buy a new piece. Let me practice some recovery, bro. Let me practice some spiritual principles right now, like acceptance. That's when I always go, that's my go-to principle. Acceptance is my go-to principle. Yo, like, share, and subscribe, yo. Let's expose this shit. He's a dirtbag. He's a dirtbag. That was crazy. He was butthurt. He was by her. This is my last CI too. Mm mm mm. I felt it too. I knew it. I was like, watch some, watch some crazy shit happen for me recording his car. Watch. And y'all be like, he don't tell all his friends. Yeah, you like that? Smack the phone out his hand. Yeah, you a bitch, nigga, cause you in uniform. You a bitch, nigga. You a bitch, nigga. Straight like that. Tell all your friends, yeah, I smacked the phone out of saying you a bitch, nigga. You did that and you walked away, nigga. Knowing you in uniform, nigga. Straight bitch made.
crazy. Insane. Do you see the the um, power does whatever it wants kind of shit? Like they just they feel like they can do whatever the fuck they want, bro. Excuse me. I had to spit in the street. I know y'all don't like my spit, but I always say excuse me, so that's the best I can do is say excuse me. This is 7th Precinct in the Lower East Side. I'm gonna end this video. 11 minutes. Let's get this, let's get his face out there. Let's expose this fucking coward tyrant. Just throw the hands, bro. We can meet, we can meet at a, at a gym and have a friendly sparring session, bro. Since you're so tough. We can work out together. You know what I mean? Niggas don't want to work out together. They rather do coward shit like that. Till next time.